Um, good morning and welcome back to the Pentiac Wilderness YouTube channel. Uh, for those of you who've been following this channel, you'll know that we've been on a bit of a break the last couple months. Uh, and anyone new to the channel, I wanted to just put out a video to let you know what we're about and uh, where we're going from here. Um, so uh, the reason we haven't had any videos out lately is uh, nothing to do with projects. There's been lots of things on the go. But uh, my sister and her husband had their first child this summer. Um, their child's now about two months old. And uh, my sister does a lot of uh, work and help with the video part of the channel and some behind the scenes stuff, as well as she appears in some of the videos. But as a result of that, we haven't had as many videos out, but we've got uh, content and things we're working on going into the fall here. So that's, that's why we've been on a bit of a break. In terms of who we are as Pentiac Wilderness YouTube channel, we're based and located in Eastern Canada. And essentially what this channel has started as is myself and some family members and friends working and building a dovetail style log cabin. Um, and you'll see that behind me. The dovetail style of cabin that I've built is a one of many types of cabin. There's countless different ways to build a cabin and this is one way I chose. And it's modeled after some cabins that I saw um, in the eastern part of the Czech Republic uh, several years ago. The uh, other projects that I've been up to on this channel uh, include building a tool shed, storage shed, work shed, and uh, an outhouse that you can see behind me. So again, there's videos to both of those on the channel as well, as well as just other things that are related to off-grid cabins, uh, solar power, um, and uh, living off-grid. In terms of where the uh, channel's going from here, I've actually started a, a, another fairly large project, which is an extension to the cabin. And part of the reason I started that is I've transitioned from living elsewhere to, to living in the cabin, and I'm going to see how that goes. Um, but as I moved here, I had to pare down my possessions and different things that I had and, uh, and transition into living into a smaller space. And uh, anyway, at, in the end, I decided that probably a little bit more space would be useful, um, combined with the fact I just like doing this type of work. So, so as we go into the fall, some of the videos that we're going to put out show me doing um, an extension to the cabin. The style of construction is, is not dovetail. I'm using, I guess you might call it... Um, a post and beam sort of structure with four walls framed in. Um, so anyway, I'll show that uh, progression as we go through, but that's what we've been up to. And uh, right now in the short term, we've been getting firewood ready, um, piling firewood, storing firewood, that sort of thing, because this time of year in this part of Canada, you know, you're getting into fall. It's nice to have your wood uh, in a place that uh, is, is sort of accessible and ready for winter because when winter comes it can sometimes come quickly and uh, you want to be prepared for that. Um, for those of you following the channel, thank you. Apologies for uh, not having videos out as frequently as usual. And um, for anyone new, hopefully this is a good overview of what we're all about. And, and if you haven't seen any of our videos, feel free. Uh, or um, hopefully we'll get some out in the next uh, few weeks. So thanks everyone. Uh, thanks for being part of this and uh, have a good day. Mm -hmm.